When BitTitan puts out a product, it calls on two individuals to demonstrate those products to the world. Daryl Jekyll Webster, super genius, and Jethro Brainiac Seegers, evil mastermind. <laughs> when they aren't pushing the envelope of string theory or searching for the Higgs boson, they demonstrate the high power BitTitan product line oh. in Daring Demos with Daryl and Jethro. Oh. Nice. She goes. Hey, look, 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 look. Doo -doo. Hey, hey, we're back, we're back. Oh, yeah. Yep, oh, let me get that. You take, I got that. You, you take that. You take that. Hey, uh, welcome back with Daring Demos with Daryl and Jethro, also known as D Man. Uh, today we have a question from Catherine. She wants to know a little bit more about our product deployment prop. Okay. It's a part of our MSP complete offering. Um, and if you step into my office, I'm going to show you how it works. Now deployment pro, very easy. What it does is a reconfiguration of your Outlook profile after the migration. The way that it works, and we're going back to our awesome dashboard, MSP complete, where you manage all your customers, all your devices, and all your users. And you have a service module, which is called Deployment Pro. Now, Deployment Pro works on a basis of the DMA agent. And Daryl, what did DMA stand for? Device Management Agent. Absolutely, so Device Management Agent. And that Device Management Agent is going to look at the original Outlook profile and is going to do the reconfiguration into a new Outlook profile while keeping the same settings. So what happens is after the migration, you just go into MSPC or MSP Complete, you select the right device or the right user that you want to flip over, and in Deployment Pro, you schedule the flip over. So what the DMA agent is going to do, it's going to ask our MSPC, Hey, do I need to do anything? And it will say, yeah, you need to flip over the Outlook profile. So that will spin up a user interface. It's going to ask for the username and password for their Office 365 account. We will validate that. And then we're going to reconfigure the Outlook profile. Now we're going to make sure that it completely is configured to connect to Office 365. So, you know, if you have Exchange and the Active Directory attributes are not cleaned up, that might be a little bit of a hurdle to take. We actually do that for you. We do it remotely so you don't have to go and travel to all these different devices. We provide a dashboard in MSPC or MSP Complete where you can see which devices are done and which ones still need to go through. But it's very important that you understand what we do with that Outlook profile. So, like I said, we create the connection to Office 365, but we're also going to make sure that the autocompletes that everybody uses a lot, you know, you go into your two form, you see all the people that you've sent an email to, that is being copied over instantaneously. Good. Signatures that you use. And also every PST that was connected to your original profile will be there as well. When that is done, we will send back to the dashboard that the configuration has been completed successfully. So the partner sees, hey, this device is done. It's he, all, he or she also sees which devices still need to be cut over. So it gives you a full overview of what you're doing. And at that point on the user desktop or device, Outlook will open, the new profile will be loaded, and it's the same environment with their new emails from Office 365. So everything is there. So they have a full flip over of the profile, and that is just an awesome user experience. And as a partner, you can integrate that with your mailbox migration and with the other service module for health check for Office 365 before the migration. And it's all based on that awesome agent, the DMA agent. So, Catherine, I hope this answers your question. It is an awesome tool to try out. Go into MSP Complete and try to figure this out onto your, uh, onto your customers, all your users, and their computers. And you're going to see it's definitely worth your while. So, thank you so much.